The atom is our future. It is a subject everyone wants to understand. So we felt it was the most important topic for a Tomorrowland program. In fact, we considered it so important that we embarked on several atomic projects. For one, we made plans to build an exhibit at Disneyland that will show you atomic energy in action. Now, our atomic projects here at the studio are twofold. We prepared this program and also a book so that we could tell you this important story in full detail. Both grew together. We gave them the same title, and many of the illustrations appear in both. As you can see, we found ourselves deep in the field of nuclear physics. Of course, we don't pretend to be scientists. We're storytellers. So we combine the tools of our trade with the knowledge of experts. We added a nationally known scientist to our staff to head our new science department. His first assignment was to write the book on the atom and to help us in developing this program. And here to tell you the story of our friend the atom is the author of our book, Dr. Heinz Haber. As we developed our story of the atom, we made an amazing discovery. We had a science story, but suddenly we realized that it was almost like a fairy tale. By a strange coincidence, our story turned out to be like the old fable from the Arabian Nights, the fisherman and the genie. This tale tells of an age-old wish of man, a wish to be the master of a mighty genie that does his bidding. There was once an old fisherman who lived in great poverty. One day, after casting his net many times, he happened to pull ashore a brazen vessel. Its mouth was closed with a lead stopper. Marveling at his strange catch, the fisherman said, I'll wager that whatever is sealed so well must contain something of great value. Presently thou wilt have to die. Heaven forbid, or at least tell me why. As I lay imprisoned in that tiny jar for many centuries, my anger grew and grew until I swore in my heart that my liberator should perish. What a cruel trick fate hath dealt me. Trick? Hmm. Oh, genie, since thou art determined upon my death, grant me this one last question. Well? How can one as mighty and powerful as thou dwell in so tiny a vessel? What? Thou dost not believe me? Not till I have seen it done can I believe it. <laughs> Watch then. Now you shall return to the sea. Nay, nay, I did not mean what I said. Ah, no, no, release me, and I keep my solemn vow to grant thee three wishes. Strangely enough, our story is like that fable, come true through science. We are like the fishermen. For centuries, we have been casting our net into the sea of the great unknown in search of knowledge. And finally, we found a vessel. And like the one in the fable, it contains a genie. A genie hidden in the atoms of this metal, uranium. Let me show you. This is a Geiger counter. It tells us that the genie is here, imprisoned in these atoms. So this is our story. How the vessel was discovered, how the genie was liberated, 
how he first threatened to kill, and how he was finally harnessed to grant us three wishes.